Okay. So this was the or this is the second half or well, I guess technically third half now of um, these O20s. This is the one that I just recently had on there. As you can see, the damage on those ears are busted off, and uh, it kind of ran ran really good for a few seconds there, but that was all she had left in her. So we got our or my second O20 on there. This one has. Uh, stupid freaking cameras never focus. This one has a an exhaust throttle on it, which is all the way well, about half open right now. So we're gonna leave it to start it is about halfway. Um, got our fuel ready. This is mounted on there, and we are going to go outside and start it up in a minute. Okay. We're outside. I'm gonna see if I can stick my phone against something so I can film and uh, actually get a bit of a running video in. Okay, let's see if we can go right. I don't know if you guys can see that. Oh, yeah, it's in there. Move my foot of the way so you guys don't have to look at that nasty thing again for a while. Okay, so we're going to. All full. I'm going to add fuel to the exhaust port. Almost what you need to do is just take the whole engine, just dunk it in a bucket of fuel to prime them. <laughs> this one has significantly more compression than the other one. This one actually does run quite well. And we are going to go two, three, four and a half, maybe five turns ish. Okay, let's get this on the go. Okay, make sure that's going to work. You don't need to wind these things up so you're stupid tight, you just got to wind them a little bit. Just a little engine. Oh, well, that's positive. that exhaust rod a little bit. Oh, come on now. <laughs> I tried. These little things can be so friggin' finicky sometimes. Uh, yeah, okay. Can't wait to the day to actually have myself a real video camera. That'll be freaking excellent. Uh, same thing as the other one. Mmm, <laughs> love the smell of burning clots. It smells so good. Sometimes you can. Stupid thing. Why are you so stupid? I guess that's what happens when you don't run them for a very long time is they kind of get really stubborn and hard to start. This one used to start run like every first flip with your fingers. No, it doesn't want to do that. I was going to make an ass out of me, like I said. Oh, well, maybe not. Oh, for Pete's sake. Try to open that needle up a little bit more. I assure you this one does run really nicely, actually. I ran time. 
Okay, so five minutes of watching me try to start this stupid thing. Hopefully it's all in frame. Stupid exhaust spring always hits the prop. Well, let's try that again and see what happens. This thing hasn't run in. Oh, just about enough. Oops. Two years. So, I have to give it some kind of whatever. Let's add some more. I kind of hate those spring starts. They kind of wander into the prop eventually, and it's kind of annoying. So, Burp. Stupid spring. Anyways, well you guys saw it run. It's just that stupid fucking spring keeps getting in the way. Let's see if it'll start up again. That and the exhaust throttle was closing. <laughs> 